Day, this is the Professor, CB Hamdi PhD, and today is Wednesday, June 7, 2023. It is 10.06 and 51 seconds, p.m. Eastern Daylight Time, and today's research, holographic display. So let's come to it here, a hole in one for holographic display. Tiny pinholes in a thin film can pave the way for more widespread applications. For 3D holographic displays, date April 18, 2019, SARS, the Korea Advanced Institute of Science and Technology. Researchers in Korea have designed an ultra-thin display that can project dynamic, multicolored 3D holographic images, according to a new study. The system critical component is a thin film, a titanium film, with tiny holes that precisely correspond with each pixel, the liquid crystal display, LCD panel. And this film acts as a photon sleeve. Each pinhole diffracts light, emerging from them widely, resulting in a high-definition 3D image, observable from a wide angle. The entire system is very small. They use a 1.8 inch off-the-shelf LCD panel with a resolution of 1024 times 768, a titanium film, Attached to the back of the panel is a mere 300 nanometers thick. The prone suggests that holographic displays can be projected from thin devices like a cell phone. The team demonstrated their approach by producing a hologram of a moving tricolored cube. And specifically, the images are made by pointing differently colored laser beams made in parallel light waves at the small LCD panel. The photon sleep as a hole for each pixel in the LCD panel. The holes are precisely positioned to correspond to the pixels. Active area, the pinholes diffract the light, emerging from them, producing 3D images. As previous studies, researchers used optical diffusers for the same purpose, but the size of the device was bulky and difficult to be operated, and it took a long period of time to calibrate. In the present work, on the other hand, tailored their photon sim to demonstrate a simple, compact and scalable method for 3D holographic display. This technique can be readily applied to existing LCD displays. Applications for holograms have been limited by cumbersome techniques, high computation requirements, and poor image quality. Improving current techniques can lead to a wide variety of applications, including 3D cinema, viewing without the need for glasses, watching holographic videos on television and smartphone screens. And this is a professor, professor of advanced physics, mathematics, computer science, and leader of research. This video was created for educational purposes only. Hope you enjoyed listening. Until next time, have an awesome day.